पीरियड सिक्सटी फाइव टू परसेंट और अभी हम लोग किस इपोच में है एरा हैज बीन ये सेनोजेक एरा है सेनोजेक एरा में विच आर द टू पीरियड टर्सरी एंड क्वार्टर में अंडर द टर्सरी दीज आर वॉट इपोच E plus P become EP. Era converted into period. Period converted into epoch. Era, period, epoch. E plus P become EP. Era, period, epoch. Understood? और इससे पहले जो होता है वो आपको जब मैं rock system कराऊंगा eon. What is there? Eon. so or all these are epoch all these are epoch within the tertiary period these are paleocene eocene oligocene miocene pliocene and during the quaternary period pleistocene and holocene and rock system ke liye indian rock system ke liye ye sare cheez aane chahiye understood we are saying that first if i am coming on to the first you know that uh, and all of you know that uh, in the world map this eurasian plate is moving i said that is toward eurasian plate and this indian gondwana plate is moving northward yes and when the indian gondwana plate was here at that time yahan pe kya tha what is there tethian sea what is this tethian sea or this tethian sea was attached to the indian gondwana plate and all or ye it is moving towards this direction and its direction movement is eastward so around 120 million years ago figure aapka acha drawn hona chahiye you can understand it better i said uh, and figure can give you better understanding This is in a continental plate. ध्यान में रखिएगा मैं प्लेट टेक्टोनिक में ये पढ़ाता नहीं होगा यहाँ पर आपको बताता हूँ आई सेट दैट देर इज इन दिस इज इन इंडियन गोंडवाना प्लेट एंड इन बिटवीन देर इज इन टेथिस सी इज देर वट इज देर एंड दिस इज इन टेथिस ओशियानिक प्लेट एंड टेथिस ओशियानिक प्लेट इज डेंसर दैन continental plate because oceanic plate is made up of basalt and when they are converging with nahi aap jaane when they are converging then oceanic plate will what subduct because it is denser therefore it will subduct and here we have Eurasian oceanic plate. Which oceanic plate? I said that. And uh, and this is an Eurasian. Sorry, ocean Eurasian continental plate. And this portion is Eurasian oceanic plate. Understood? And it is an Indian Gondwana, and that is a continental. जो भी फूला हुआ है इसका मतलब वो continental है. And जो थोड़ा सा पतला है इसका मतलब क्या है? It is what? oceanic so the first hame kaun sa stage hai stage 1 in the stage 1 i said that there is an what we have to talk about eo geo syncline and meo geo syncline so this structure was existing and how many years ago i am talking about 120 million years ago means i said that in the early 
Cretaceous. Which period I said that? Early Cretaceous. In the early Cretaceous period, what is happening? There is an a what? Oceanic, oceanic converges. Which converges is taking place? And then, ye more pure oceanic, it is less pure, near to the continent. So, which oceanic plate will be denser? This tethys oceanic plate will be more denser. Understood? And thereafter, I said that oceanic, oceanic convergence is taking place around 120 million years ago. And, yahaan par kya hua? I said that in this reason, if I am talking about, in this reason, first uh, due to the friction, due to the, what I said that, when one plate is going below, there is a, due to the friction, there is a formation of magma. There is a formation of magma or yaha par, there is a formation of magma like I said that, endocytic magma. And this endocytic magma started erupting out due to friction temperature in case in a formation of magma. So, endocytic me kya hota hai? Silica and iron. Both are lag bag. Aur yeh dono oceani plate and then it is. Aur bhoat sari factor mein batata hoon. There is a release of pressure, friction, addition of water. Aur yeh erupt shuwa and there is a formation of. So, yaha pe kya hoa? So, I will tell you, around 120 million years ago, Indian Gondwana plate is moving northward towards, towards Eurasian continental plate which is moving eastward but relatively stationary because it is not moving southward. So, relatively it is what? Moving eastward but relatively stationary because it is not moving southward. During the movement, the plate speed is around, I said that 5 to 10 centimeter per year. What is the speed was there? Movement speed is 5 to 10 centimeter per year and during that denser tethys oceanic plate subducted below less denser Eurasian oceanic plate and during the subduction and during the subduction then there is in a some types of and, and a friction if you remember friction ke wajay se temperature release of pressure and addition of water formation of endocytic magma and thoda sa granitic and that causes volcanic eruption and volcanic eruption causes formation of volcanic mountain or a volcanic mountain jo bana this volcanic mountain is known as dras reason and Kohistan volcanic mountain island formed which are the island has been formed Dras and Kohistan these are the volcanic island arc which has been formed over there understood series of so if I am talking about uh, this is killer this is okay killer and after that, ye kya ban gaya? it has been a great good amount of volcanic eruption. And now, thereafter, in this reason, kya ho hai? Tell me. Deposition of sediments. Or ye bohat samay tak ye chalta raha. And deposition of sediment has filled up with this reason. Or ye reason saath mein aise. Ye filled ho gaya. Understood? And that is in a deposited sediment become EO geosync line. Geosync line. Deposited sediment jo ki buckled ho ke convert ho ga, That is known as I said that geosync line. Or the geosync line which is volcanic and earthquake effective. Volcanically active. So, jab tak ocean jata rahega, Until unless ocean plate is going on. Volcanic eruption will take place. So, this geosync line is known as yes. If I am talking about Japan, if I am talking about, I said that uh, Kuril Island all, I manage of geosync line prior to that time, I said that it is an EO geosync line. What I said that? EO geosync line. So, what is the meaning? And then, so, what do we do? Yes, tell me. The two geosync line has been formed. One, it is an EO geosync line. And it has been formed by the deposition of sediment by the rivers. And it is uh, near where? 
यूरेशियन प्लेट नियर यूरेशियन प्लेट के पास मुझे क्या बन गया नियर यूरेशियन प्लेट दर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ एंड इट इज वोल्कैनिकली इट इज वोल्कैनिकली एक्टिव एंड नियर इंडियन गोंडवाना प्लेट देर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ मियो जियो and that is I said that यहां पर deposition of sediment is keep on happening yes but it is not and it is converting into also geosync line but it is not in a volcanically active so it is in a passive yes it is in a which kind of geosync line passive geosync line passive geosync line और कहां बना near गोंडवाना plate Understood? Simple. ये पिक्चर सारा याद हो गया आप क्या कहोगे इन द अर्ली क्रिटेशियस पीरियड अराउंड वन ट्वेंटी मिलियन ईयर्स अगो इंडियन गोंडवाना प्लेट वॉज मूविंग नॉर्थ वर्ड विद ए स्पीड ऑफ फाइव टू टेन सेंटीमीटर पर ईयर अंडरशूड टूवर्ड द यूरेशियन कॉन्टिन यूरेशियन प्लेट विच इज मूविंग ईस्ट वर्ड बट रिलेटिवली स्टेशनरी रिलेटिवली and then in between tethys oceanic plate was existing and this tethys oceanic plate started subducting below what eurasian oceanic plate in the form of ocean ocean convergence in the form of which i said that ocean ocean convergence and uh, During the convergence, volcanic eruption took place with the some uh, andesitic magma and some kind of I said that um, granite and has been come into existence through the friction, through the addition of water and release of pressure. And then volcanic island arc formed are Dras and Kohistan. Dras and Kohistan. In this region, further deposition of sediment near to the Eurasian plate created what? Active volcanically active geosync line, it is known as Yo geosync line, and then there is in a formation of what a deposition of sediments near to the what Indian Gondwana plate has made in a passive volcanically passive, and it is known as Mio Geo sync line. Understood? So, I said. Uh, it means i said that when it is moving towards then first which convergence has been taken place oceanic oceanic convergence which convergence has been taken place oceanic and oceanic convergence and due to this oceanic and oceanic convergence what form dras and kohistan volcanic island arc understood it now further further समझ में आ गया एंड देन फॉर डिपोजिशन ऑफ सेडिमेंट हैज मेड नियर यूरेशियन प्लेट व्हाट नियर यूरेशियन प्लेट मेड व्हाट योजियोसिंक लाइन एंड मियोजियोसिंक लाइन सो दिस इज द फर्स्ट स्टेज सेकंड स्टेज वी आर कमिंग टुवर्ड्स व्हिच वन व्हिच वन आई सेड दैट फॉर्मेशन ऑफ टेथियन हिमालय फॉर्मेशन ऑफ टेथियन हिमालय स्टेज 2 I said uh, formation of Tethian Himalay or Trans Himalayas. Okay.
Understood? So, three types of convergence you will see oceanic oceanic convergence, ocean continental convergence, and then you will see continental continental convergence. Now, the second stage formation of Tethyan Himalaya and Trans Himalayas, and this time I am talking about it is, I said that uh, Trans it is, I said that 70 to 55 million years ago. Which one I said that? 70 to 55 million years ago means late Cretaceous to the which one I said that Paleocene late Cretaceous to Paleocene 65 to 58 me kya ho gaya tha Paleocene finished means around 55 third which one has gone formation of Tethyan Himalaya so now ab kya dekhenge I said that what I say that now, there slowly and slowly, this uh, plate will keep on going downward and then, uh, par humne kya dekha? this Tethys Oceanic Plate, sorry, Indian Gondwana Plate which has come more near and already deposited sediments in this region. Yes or not? Yahan pe kya ho Deposition of, or bhi ho gaya, this is a new geocentric line come closer and further other deposition and it become these two geosync line all get together become tethys geosync line it becomes what what it becomes tethys geosync line so now the second one that we are going to see <coughs> i said that uh, Second stage I am talking about Tethys